In May of 1944, exterminating the Jewish race remained Hitler's top priority. The number of trains to the death camps multiplied. These human shipments were brutally inhumane. Up to 100 people packed into a single cattle car. No food, no water, no toilet, little air. Some trips lasted up to 10 terrifying days. Holocaust survivor Elie Wiesel remembers his own journey in his book, Night. There was a woman among us, a certain Mrs. Schechter. I knew her well. Mrs. Schechter had lost her mind. On the first day of our journey, she had already begun to moan. Later, her sobs and screams became hysterical. Fire, I see a fire. Some pressed against the bars to see. There was nothing, only the darkness of night. She's mad, poor woman. But days later, as young Ellie stepped off the cattle car here at Birkenau, he would smell the stench of burning human flesh. There were fires, the crematorium was throwing yeah. its flames yeah. in the sky. I yeah. thought, first of all, of Mrs. Schechter. I mean, Mrs. Schechter, who was who on the saw, the fire, saw the saw fire. fire. Mm -hmm. But the screaming, the screaming, the screaming, she wasn't so mad at all. She, she was a prophet. And we didn't listen. Why, very strange. I think maybe it's the end of history. 